Welcome at this uh, review for the Koinor Magic Pencils. And they're Koinor Hartmuth. And this one is uh, like a triangle. And uh, this one is six sided. And as you can see, there are all kinds of colors inside of the lead. For this uh, drawing, I will uh, using uh, a gray paper. But to demonstrate uh, here first I will use a white paper and as you can see there are all kinds of colors inside those pencils. At first I thought they were for children but actually you can make uh, some fun drawings with them. This is the magic one. You can see the colors are very very bright indeed. So I grabbed some uh, out of the store where I was and uh, this is my Stratmore sketchbook and it's grayish which is ideal for this demonstration because uh, what I want to do is to make a very very quick sketch of a uh, bird of paradise flower and what I did is I simply uh, watched Google Images for well the many kinds there are there are so many kinds of these flowers you cannot imagine and uh, this one I'm drawing just uh, out of heart and I'm simply using a gray color pencil for the setup of my sketch and here I'm putting in a little bit of shadow that is behind the flower just to give it a little bit of 3d dimension and I'm not putting in detail because uh, what I want to demonstrate is what you can do when you take this uh, Koinor white charcoal uh, I do not believe white charcoal exists actually because uh, charcoal is always black in my imagination but I think it's just a white pastel, but it's the white Koinor uh, charcoal pencil. And I want to put in a underlayment for the magic pencils to demonstrate for you. Well, here we go. And what you can see is that in an instant you get uh, all kinds of colors by just using one pencil now I thought it was really nice because I wanted to be a quick sketch uh, and maybe one day you are in a zoo or something or somewhere uh, a botanical garden and you can actually make very very quick sketches with these magic pencils so check them out maybe it's something for you and here the green is very green so uh, now I'm going over it with the blue magic pencil and if you think it's still too bright you can always use the gray standard color pencil to go over the leaf in this case Okay, now for some fine detail, I'm taking the black standard color pencil. This one is also Koinor. And with that pencil, I can put in some detail in the leaf, but also in the leaf uh, of the flower itself. And here I'm putting in some shadows special detail to make those uh, leaves pop out it's the, the petals I believe they're called uh, the flower itself and on the points 
of this one in case uh, there are some dark, really dark points. So I'm using that black for that. And here also for a little bit of detail to make the leaf um, kind of rounded. And what I've also noticed is uh, that some of these flowers have a... I do not know how you call it in English. It's, it's a stamp or something. And in this one, this is a really bright blue one. And I think that's so nice because the blue is uh, complementary with the orange for the flower petals. So I wanted to draw that in too. And it's kind of a botanical drawing, if you want. And well, it's it's really really quick. Here for the points, I go over with the black magic uh, pencil again. And you can see uh, it's kind of like they're flaming. I love that effect. And maybe the co the colors are too bright for you. I think they are very bright indeed. I do not like it, but it can work for you. So, hope you will give it a try and maybe it's helpful for you. Give it a big thumbs up and I hope to see you again in my next tutorial. Take care.